Hello Blender user with you Abdul Sheikh from Blender Workshop. It's a while uh, without doing uh, any tutorial. Uh, in this video I will make comparison between Cycle Render and uh, Corner Render. Why Corner? Corner is fast. Uh, this what I hear is fast. It's like a uh, very very render engine. Uh, now we can I can you can see the result with Cycle. 11 uh, took 11 minutes. Okay. Now I will jump to the render angel corona. But uh, before I do that, I will show you how to install it. Be, uh, you go to the Blender artist on uh, Joel. Thanks, Joel, for the for the script. Now we we can get, you can download corona standard binary here and the relevant file and download vendor exporter of Bluetooth here. Uh, first of all, we download the I already do that. After that, we download the render corona exporter. Uh, I will show you how to install it. We go to the folder and of install Blender, like this. File, open file location. Okay, we go to the file location, to, to the script folder in the add-on. And now we we passed the under corner here. Where is this under under? Okay, this is under corner. Okay. After to do that, we go to we jump uh, in Blender. We go to File, User Preferences, the computer is, is a little slow. Okay, we go to the add-on, we go to the render, after that we check the little box here, Corona, but we don't forget to set up to set up the corner path to the download corner standalone like this and in the corner standalone we download and we click accept now we go to the corner we change uh, I will do some change the first uh, render is uh, with cycle now we go to I will make some change. We go here and we M move the, the first layer. Okay, now we we do some change with the material. Okay, for the glossy, you can uh, go to the shock for tutorial. It's a good uh, resource for uh, uh, the introduction with the Corona Lander engine, we go to the the shader system. Basic example here, we can use, see the glossy. Uh, we jump into, we change, uh, we start with our plastic shader with default, and this is plastic shader, we go to the metallic shader. Okay, we jump to three. We have to change the reflection value to 0.80 and the uh, front strength to eight. This way, this I will do. We go to diffuse 0.8, and for no, not this. In the refreshing review, 0.8 and 8. Okay, now uh, diffuse 0.40. And forty, okay. And the color point six. We go to ashes and point six. Okay. And for the last step is changing shadow glossiness. In this case, it's point fifty in the reflection tab. Okay, we do that. Glossiness point sixty. Okay, and we finish with the glossy metal shader. I forget to. Okay, now we name is this metal. Okay, now for the glass material, we go to we jump to. Okay, we change the reflection event to one. We call glass. 
the reflection uh, level to one. Uh, the reflection level uh, uh, reflection and the uh, fraction oh, okay okay one reflection one and for reflection 0.75 and 1.50 okay for the reflection 0.75 and 1.5 and for the refraction I think uh, one. One point five. Okay, now uh, five. Are we go to we done with the okay. Uh, for the elimination, I use. I will okay. Okay, now I will do that for. We choose a glass. Okay. Metallic. Metal. Okay. I forgot uh, how to set up for the texture. We jump to the new layer, we add a plane, we, we unwrap the plane like this, unwrap, okay, I think, uh, okay, okay, not problem, we go to the image editor, okay. Now, new material, we go to the texture, we choose image for movie, open, we go to the texture, map, wood diffuse, okay. Okay, now we go to here, shock for diffuse, okay. Now we go to the here in the text panel. We check the, the T box and we activate show texture setting. And here we can choose the texture. Okay, thanks for watching this and thank you. Now uh, we go to the under, uh, world render. I set up uh, the f white color and the corner sun. I check the activate the corner sun for the size multiplier two and for the energy multiplier six. Uh, bluish, little bluish color. Uh, we set up the the path to export path, and we we done. We hit we. We choose all the scene and hit export. We can choose here. We can see the export file here. Progress waiting. Uh, took uh, seven point nine seconds. Now we hit under and magic happen. We can sh see here. And for the explorer, the commander is. We have to wait. I think uh, sometime we do some problem. We do another time. Ah, you can see. I don't know why this happened. Okay, now the calendar. You can uh, download the Process Explorer from uh, SiceInternal, www.siceInternal.com You can see here, the calendar is, is launched. We will see...
you have to wait some time okay you can see the I think I made uh, some uh, I have some problem okay I will stop the under stop the okay now it's good after 10 minutes 10 min I will pause the recording now after 10 minutes I will uh, show you the result okay I see you later okay after 10 minutes this is uh, the render took 11 uh, minutes you can see we can constant here the the scene is a little bit darker from here is uh, lightly we can uh, fix that by going to the color map and changing some value here one you can see the scene is more brighter we can uh, change the iso of the high high light compressor to contrast like 1.5 okay white balance 70000 like this okay we you can see the result here I think Corona is good for the Matex shader. You can see here. Uh, for the cycle, I, I simply do the base uh, metallic. Thanks for watching and uh, I see you in the another tutorial. Okay, I'm from Blandon Workshop with you Abdul Sheikh. Goodbye.